So back in November I bought this Renault Clio Turbo from my subscriber Danish. The plan was to buy the car, get it tidied up and give my subscribers a chance to win it for free. Since buying the car I've had the wheels refurbed at RRT UK, I've had a new exhaust fitted because the old one didn't look too clever if I'm honest. We got it MOT'd, stuck a fresh set of plates on. Then last week on the Planet of Dreams Instagram I announced the winner of the Renault Clio in its finished state. A massive congratulations to my subscriber and loyal supporter of my channel, Adam Gammon from Bridgend. Well, it is ringing. It is ringing. Hello, is that Adam? Speaking Adam, it's Calvin from Calvin's Car Diary. You right, mate? Yeah, what's happening, bro? You okay? Yeah, yeah, I'm good, man. I'm good. Well, I'm ringing, mate. Do you know the little Renault Clio, the 1.2 that we got off Danish a couple of weeks ago? Yeah, yeah. You just, you just won it, mate. It's yours. <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations, man. <laughs> Guys, a quick reminder before we get on with this video, I'm going to be announcing the winner of the Toyota Yaris T-Sport live on the Planet of Dreams Instagram tomorrow at midday. Enter now for free, the link for Planet of Dreams is in the description below. Good to meet you Adam. Um, you come from a bit of a journey away, don't you? Yeah, a bit of a, bit of a drive. Bridge ends, yeah? Yeah, yeah. So, um, you ain't seen the car yet, have you? No. Come and have a look at the Clio, man. <laughs> it's been a bit of a mission this morning, isn't it? Uh, let's get round here. You actually had a Clio before, didn't you? I did, yeah. Come on, come and have a look at it, man. Come and have a look at it. <laughs> Do you saw the initial video of the car? Yeah. Uh, it, when it came in, it wasn't in a great state, was it? No. And uh, we've had a, quite a lot done to it. We've had the wheels done. We've had a few little stickers put on it. We've had the overall, like the bodywork tidied up. We've had, uh, what else did we get done? The, the, the wing mirrors. The wing mirrors, the new, the, the new mirrors, wasn't it? Door handles. Stickers, wheels refurbed. Wheels were done by RRT oh, UK. A couple of, it's, it's looking tidy, isn't it? It's looking, looking nice tidy. Car. So you're, obviously you're the winner. How much did it cost you to win this car? Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Absolutely so free. It's, it's a free car. Just, Come a little bit closer because it's a bit windy out here, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, yeah. It's very windy. So you come down from Bridge End today. Bridge End, yeah. So you, was you born in Swansea? Is Sw that right? Swansea Just by through and through. Yeah. Swansea's your home. Yeah. And then yeah. you moved to Bridge End recently. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Wicked. So how long was your journey down here today? About three and a half hours. Really? Yeah. Bloody hell, man. <laughs> So you got here bright and well, I say bright and early this morning. I bet you're looking forward to getting it home, aren't you? Yeah, can't wait to take it. Let's go wander around the front of it. Uh, I'm trying to think what else to be. Oh, we also had some new plates done by your car, Red, as well. Shout yeah. out to them. So the fresh, fresh new number plates. It's just a tidy looking car now, isn't it? So it's stuck and smart. It's looking really, really smart. It really is. Really clean. So yeah. what's, what's your situation then? So you're, you're a chef by trade, is that right? I, well, yeah. Um, so I work in the kitchen. So mm -hmm. I work in the kitchen a couple of years. Mm -hmm. um, two kids. Yeah. Bloody hell, fair play, man. Yeah. Two kids. You, you look well young. How, how old are you? I'm 22. 22 with two kids. Yeah. Well done, mate. Oh, congratulations, <laughs> man. I love that. That's wicked. Yeah, two, two kids. So you obviously live with your, your family in Bridge End then? Yeah, yeah, missus. Yeah. What's, what's the car situation at the minute? driving her car she's learning how to drive so i've had to get what i call a dyson which is a kia <laughs> <laughs> not a bad car though uh, it's right? got no power though <laughs> <laughs> um yeah so i'm, I'm not sure uh, probably just so currently currently you don't have your own car yeah, yeah? currently oh. don't have my own vehicle yeah. until now until now. until now so you're planning to keep the clio then yeah um yeah, I'm, I'm hoping so. Yeah. Um, I don't know. I have to go back now and see what happens. It's uh, probably a bit small for a man with two kids, it isn't it? Is, yeah, it is. But it's a car, so. It's a car. We'll see. We'll see what happens now. Um, financially and everything, yeah, we'll see what happens. Well, there's a financial gain there, regardless, isn't there? So yeah. you can sell it, cash in, go and buy whatever you want that's with the money. The, well, that's partly my thinking as well. Yeah. The financial situation with the kids and everything. But yeah, we'll see what happens. I think what we'll do now. Is uh, we need to head out on the road, don't we? Yeah, let you drive it. Are you insured in that now? I'll, I can sort of insure it. I can take a picture of it. Cool, yeah. let's let's do that and then we'll head yeah. out. Yeah, key lots there. Yeah, it is, mate. Oh, Push button to start yeah. there. Look, very posh, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> it's turned out to be an all right car. There you go. Nice one. Starts on the button now because we had to put a starter motor on it, didn't we, Adam? Yeah, so yeah. There has been a bit of a delay for Adam picking up his car because. 
I got in it the other day and it wouldn't start, yeah? And we kind of concluded that it needs a new starter motor. So I was like, Adam, um, before we pick it up, we need to put a starter motor on it. So that's done and yeah, yeah. It's, it's, it's good, mate. It's all good. Mint. Yeah, let's, let's go for a drive, make sure it drives all right, yeah? We've even got fuel in it now because Sammy's just put a whole jerry can in it. Feeling generous today, mate. <laughs> Giving away cars and full jerry cans of fuel. We've got a license, yeah? Well, I hope so. <laughs> <laughs> Got little vibe tweeters up there as well. I don't know how good they are, but a little Sony head unit as well. Pimped out, pimped out, mate. Pimped out. <laughs> <laughs> a little dumb valve on here, and I'll drive like you still like happy days. Yeah, like back in Swansea. <laughs> <laughs> I think when it came in, it did have a little hiss as you let off. It might still have it, I don't know, because it's got a, we've got an after aftermarket air filter on it, so oh, is it? it might hiss a little bit. So, what's the crack with um, the, the chefing industry? <laughs> So when you left school, that was your plan to do that? Or? So the old man's a chef. Oh, really? Um, so I just met him there. What's your dad's name? Craig. Craig. Yeah, yeah. So he's a chef. Um, started off washing dishes. Mm -hmm. And then it was... We'll go right out of yeah, it. Yeah, cool. It was just a job there and then. Mm -hmm. um, ideally not something I want to do long term. Mm -hmm. But it puts the food on the table a second. So, yeah. Yeah. Literally, I suppose, yeah. So how old are your kids? Uh, three years old and six months. Oh, well, blimey. That's yeah, good though, isn't it? Nice, nice gap between the two. Yeah, a young man. Yeah. Um, yeah, it's good. Well done, man. That's wicked. <laughs> Quite happy working that? Yeah, yeah. It's, it's a stressful environment. I can yeah, imagine it is. It's enjoyable though. You like very, it, yeah? Very enjoyable, yeah. So I'm guessing you work in long hours, evenings, weekends. Uh, so the place I work currently is um, it's like an eight till four sort of gig. Mm -hmm. um, it's quite lucky to be honest. Yeah, that's uh, right. It's more, it? it's more of a like, high end cafe. Oh, right. Now, but yeah, it's good, man. Oh, um, okay. Funny enough, when you rung me. Mm. Uh, oh, yeah, let's go back to that. Yeah, yeah. It was only my second day there. I do apologise for the language. Oh, right. Yeah. <laughs> Even yeah. though I was harassing your phone, wasn't I? I rang you loads of yeah. times. You yeah, must have yeah, who's this idiot ringing me? <laughs> it was me thinking it was debt collectors. And then, <laughs> <laughs> it was the man himself. <laughs> yeah, it's the complete opposite. <laughs> Someone trying to give you money. Yeah, <laughs> Oh, crazy. Oh, that's wicked. So, so you'd obviously, when did you enter for the car then? How um, did you enter immediately when you see the car go live, the video go live? I, I think I seen it on, I seen it on Instagram actually. Oh, um, right. Because I generally have a look at your content. Yeah. And then I'll like go through Planet of Dreams, that sort of thing. And mm -hmm. then, yeah, just entered it. Oh, um, wicked. Just scrolling through, I think it was, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Have you entered into any of the other cars as well? Uh, I think it's the Golf, which yeah. is up for the, this Friday. This Friday, yeah. Um, which, that's just an awesome looking car. Yeah, that's a nice looking car. Yeah, it? it'd be nice to two wins in one week. Oh, imagine that. <laughs> It'll be funny. That day will come, I'm sure. Someone's going to win two cars at some point. Yeah, cool, Surely that's going to happen. But yeah, that's a nice car. That is a really nice car. You can hear the little hiss on it, can't you? Yeah, I was going to say that. Can you hear it? Yeah. We'll give a good, go into third, see if you can... Sorry, Paul, it's not... You can hear a little... Let off. It's got a new exhaust though, isn't it? It's, it's just not blowing. It's no, 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 it's got nice. yeah, it's got, we've yeah. got a new, oh yeah, that's the other thing we've done. Yeah, yeah, exhaust, exhaust, brand new yeah. exhaust, yeah. Bloody hell. Yeah, this car just turned into a bit of a... Um, money pit. A bit of a money pit, <laughs> but luckily for you, it's, it's quite a nice thing now, so it's, nice. it's all good. <laughs> Pete is French, but yeah, it's nice, man. <laughs> <laughs> So you said you you said earlier you've actually had a Clio. This, yeah. this this era, yeah, this one of these ones. Uh, yeah. So what? Yeah, this shape had a three door. Mm -hmm. um, it was a, well, we've had the conversation, haven't we? It's yeah. not great. It wasn't a great car, but hopefully this one. Did you say it caught caught a light? Oh my god, that is yeah, bad. Yeah, yeah. It actually caught a light. So it caught a light from underneath the steering column. But how, how did that happen? What's, what's that? Um, about? Electrical fault. Blimey, because they do suffer with electrical faults, which is some another problem that we had with this car, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. So your plans for getting a car and that going forward was it was, was there a plan? So your missus is driving the Kia. Uh, Are so you managing to get by with one car? So missus, missus is learning to drive. Mm -hmm. um, so she doesn't currently have a license. No, she doesn't currently have a license. Okay. Um, I mean, to be honest, when the driving instructor sees it, she probably won't get one. But, um, <laughs> yeah. So we'll see now if she passes her test. Um, We'll, we'll we'll see what happens with this now. I'll probably go home and she'll tell me to sell it. Yeah. I'm not gonna lie. What um, I think it's it's been a common trend with people winning cars that they want to sell them because I think if you had the money in your bank today, would you go out and buy a 1.2 turbo Clio? No, probably not. You know, it's just 
you've won the car, it then becomes cash in your, yeah. it's an asset, isn't it? I mean, it's, it, this would be a great first car for yeah. somebody, you know, 1.2 turbo. Mm -hmm. I think as, as a first car, it'd be brilliant, but I've been driving for five years. Yeah. I want something a little bit more. A bit more, well, a bit more you. You, yeah. want, you want to get the money and spend it on what you want to spend it on. Yeah, yeah. and to be honest, I think if I was going to get a car, I'd get something a bit more pokey. Yeah. You know, um, like say for a first time, that's the second car. First time driver. I mean, as, as I said to my, as we was, my, me and my missus this weekend, and we were like, mm. if she didn't have that car, if she didn't go and finance that, mm. I'd keep this no problem at all. Oh, right. It'd be because a diff, completely different story, but because she's gone on finance that like sorry. three months ago. You're tied up with that one now. Yeah, a little bit, yeah. Mate, I said to you earlier, when this car came in, when I met Danish and the boy off him, one thing it has definitely got going for it is it drives spot on, doesn't it? Yeah. It, it, it's a really good driving car, but it's not the clutch is good, the gearbox is bang on. And in fairness to Danish, that is one of the things he, he repeatedly said like it's been a good car to him. I know he's kind of seeming to let it go over the years, but um, it's done 80,000 miles, you know, it's, 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 it's a pretty good little car. So it, it's, it's a cracking car for what you get, yeah, certainly. I think it's um, I think it's above your average sort of Clio, but yeah, it's mission accomplished. We've done the logbook. You're sorted basically, you've done yeah, a book, blog, blog, done an invoice, oh. payment due is zero obviously because you know, paying for free car, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's all tax and insured, so just ready for the um but probably about three and a half, four hours. Is that how long it is? Uh yeah, it took us about three and a half hours, you know, with all the stops and everything. Your dad seems like a proper nice guy. Yeah, he's, yeah. He's chilled, didn't he? Yeah, he's just really is tight. Really yeah. laid back, yeah, because I did think, oh, hopefully he's all right, he's sort of sitting around, but yeah, he's all right, isn't he? Nah, he's sound, um, yeah, it's a nice day out for him. Yeah, he seemed like he's enjoying his day. So, are you, are you working this tonight? I suppose you're off today, are you? Nah, yeah, I'm off today, back in for a couple of hours tomorrow, and then uh, be off to the weekend then. Well done, man. When, what was the first video you saw of mine on YouTube? Out of your second. Hold your mind back. I started following you in the RS6. Oh, bloody hell, quite a while ago then. So, yeah, a couple of years ago. It yeah, does, yeah. doesn't seem that long ago, but yeah, a couple of years ago. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, um. That was a beast of a car, wasn't it? Mate. Weapon. Yeah. Absolute weapon. Yeah, I love that car. I love that car. That's, a, that's, that's probably one of the cars that, I, when you sold it, I was like, nah, I should have done that. <laughs> Everyone was like, no! Nah. Why'd you sell it? I, I Why? <laughs> fell in love with the M6, didn't I? The green one. Yeah, man. It was actually this road that Ricky blew the bloody dip on it. Oh, was it? Yeah, it was <laughs> down, a bit further down, yeah. Right, so uh, I think we're going to wrap it up, man. I'm happy with I'm happy for you. Well done. Congratulations, yeah. mate. It's a free car. Thanks for supporting. Um, that's basically the rules, everyone. If you're a subscriber to my channel, uh, I'm trying to buy as many cars and other stuff as I possibly can to give back to my subscribers. It just keeps. I don't know, it keeps me busy, gives me content, content keeps everyone engaged and it's all positive as well. So I feel like you were the right person to win this car as well. I know you're not planning to keep it, but I feel like, you know, you're in a situation where you could do with a little little cash bonus and Absolutely. it all helps, doesn't it? Yeah, cheers man, so thank well, you very much. No, you're welcome mate, well done. So yeah, if you want to be in for your chance of winning anything for nothing, I'll put a link to Planet Dreams in the description below. Uh, do me a favour as well, give Planet Dreams Instagram a follow. Uh, what else do I want to say? Uh, nothing else really, I think that's everything. Is there anything you want to end the video on a high note? Is there anything you want to just throw it right into the video to say? Enter the competition. There you go, enter the competition. Anyone can win it. Anyone. And also, give him great support to this man. Get yourself a dream car, a dream catcher pass as well. It's all support, all love, isn't it? Yeah. Are you going to get yourself a dream catcher? I am now, yeah. Oh, I'm really? going to support the movement and, yeah. Well As, done, as we man. said earlier, maybe, maybe two cards. Yeah, you never know. You never know. Dream hatchers get triple entry on every prize, so you never know. You get one entry if you're a free entry person, triple entry for a dream catcher. So it's nine pound nine nine a month. It's worth it, isn't it? Worth every penny. <laughs> cool. Well, yeah. Good luck, everyone. Uh, we're doing live draws every single Friday on the Planet Dreams Instagram. So yeah, like I said, give us a follow on Planet Dreams Instagram. Uh, if you did like this video, do me a favour, hit the like button, hit subscribe if you're new. Give me a follow as well, Cameron's Car Diary Instagram, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.